other owners understand that maybe they don't. Correct. Um, and so, now you mentioned the, the shelter. We have a great shelter here in Marshfield. And um, I know that you work somewhat with Vicki and with Kevin to help them with some of those dogs yes occasionally when they have one i mean it's been two at this point you know we had one i jack and uh, now we have finn that i have at my house um i think you know when they get to the point where they because they're really good i mean they can really deal with a lot of different types of dogs and animals and behavioral issues and stuff like that but I think when it comes to the point where they're like, mm, we're not sure, they, can you evaluate this dog for mm-hmm. us and tell us where we're at? I'll keep the dog for X number of undetermined amount of time and get a really good feel for the dog, get him structured and try to get a real good feel of what kind of owner he needs to to have success. Right. And, um, you know, they come out of the shelter just, you know, snarling and drooling and everybody's scared of them. And then, you know, a couple of weeks, month into it, I realize you know, a lot of this is just lack of structure for what they need. Um, and then we just go from there to find them a home. A, a lot of what Tracy's saying is, is is very true, but she's not really being fair to herself. She's training us as much as anything else, and she's helped us with more than just a couple of dogs. Uh, we About half the dogs we get get returned to the sh- or get sent to the shelter because of the problems with their families. They're not adjusting well in their homes. They're destructive. They're disobedient. They're just unruly. Uh, We've learned more from Tracy. We're all pretty good at socializing a dog and getting it to where it's safe in a home, but we can't bring them much beyond that. We don't have Mm -hmm. those skills. Tracy does. Uh, The the big difference for us is about half of the dogs that we get are really problem dogs. And fortunately, we've been able to get every one of those dogs placed. We haven't had to put down a single dog because of behavioral issues. And 90% of that is because of the guidance we get from Tracy. So the, uh, it's been very beneficial for her to be in our uh, uh, environment and helping us as much as she has. And that's great.